What's going on guys, I'm here with some more 2012 NFL offseason talk with the Minnesota Vikings making a free agent move today and picking up wide receiver Jerome Simpson who played for the Cincinnati Bengals for the last three years and the Vikings signed him to a one year deal after finding out that Simpson is not going to be able to play for the first three games of the year due to a suspension. And so Minnesota gets Jerome Simpson for one year. Last year for Cincinnati, he posted 50 catches, 725 yards, and four touchdowns. One of those being that crazy front flip he did into the end zone. That was a big highlight from last year. But Simpson, he was productive last year. He's a vertical threat. He's got some speed, and that's what the Vikings need in their receiver right now. And I'm not sure if Simpson can be that guy for multiple seasons. Obviously, his contract will expire after this coming year. And I still expect Minnesota to take some receivers out of the draft with their 10 selections. I hope for at least two receivers, one in the mid and one in the late round, preferably. And I'll have a lot more to talk about with the Minnesota Vikings after the draft concludes Saturday, rounds 4 through 7. I'll be glued to the TV all three of those days, watching all the picks and hoping the Vikings make some solid selections. But Jerome Simpson, I like this pickup a lot. I knew he was having a visit with the Vikings over the weekend, and I was hoping the Vikings would sign him because he's young, he's a vertical threat, he's got some speed, and he had a productive year last year. That's the kind of production I was looking for out of a player to be in that vertical threat spot in this offense. Like 50 catches, 750 yards, that's perfect in my eyes. He's not going to be a number one receiver by any means, so hopefully he can be productive this year, and this proves to be a good pickup, and possibly he'll play multiple seasons in Minnesota. But we'll just have to see how everything plays out. Right now, I like this move a lot, but what do you Vikings fans out there think about this? Lack of a vertical receiver is one of the Vikings' biggest weaknesses last year, and hopefully this can fix it a little bit. And I'll have a lot more to talk about with the Minnesota Vikings after the NFL draft. Guys, I just wanted to make this quick video, talk about Jerome Simpson. Let me know what you guys think about this move for Minnesota. If it's good, if it's bad, whatever your thought is, leave it in the comments section. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.